For the first time tonight, Orlando Police Chief John Mina sits down with New 6 and he goes in detail about the newly released timeline of how his agency handled the Pulse terror attack last summer. News 6 investigator Mike DeForest is live outside OPD headquarters and Mike, he's using the report to give presentations on Pulse. Why? Well, the chief says that he feels he has an obligation and a responsibility to pass along some of the knowledge and experience that he and his team gained that morning. I want to kind of give them a sense of uh, what we did that night and how quickly we responded to that, how our training uh, prior to that event helped us during this event. When Orlando Police Chief John Mina talks to other law enforcement agencies about the Pulse nightclub attack, he shows them these photos. A lot of people, when they think active shooter type situation or terrorist type situation, they're thinking of these you know, big malls, big schools, big complexes. And what I really try and point out was how small it was inside that nightclub. It's, you know, just a little bit bigger than maybe uh, a TGI Fridays or an Outback Steakhouse. And within that, the rooms are very, very small. I show them that how close our officers were in relation to where uh, the shooter was, the bad guy was, and um, how they, they really risked their lives to stay so close to where they were at. In those presentations, Mina shares secret tactical information about how officers broke through the nightclub's walls to rescue victims and what he might have done differently. There's not a whole lot of questions. It's more so comments about the heroism, the courage, the bravery of our officers. Above all, Mina reminds other agencies to expect the unexpected. I said, don't try and compare this to a Columbine or a San Bernardino. All these incidents are, are really, really different. Speaking of San Bernardino, California, the chief says through all of this, he's become friends with the police chief there. Uh, that chief of San Bernardino has given about 100 presentations like this one uh, based on the terror attack that they had there in their community a couple of years ago. Eric. Yeah, what a